Hello, I am Test Drive, and welcome to episode 5 of Burnout here on the original Xbox. And since we used the muscle car in the last episode, we shall go ahead and use our final vehicle I can use at the moment, which is the pickup. Oh boy, and I'm going to make it yellow because I don't think I've had a yellow car yet in this Let's Play. And in this episode, we're heading on to the Twilight Grand Prix, our second to last championship, I believe. Second to last, uh, according to that, at least. I need to get in, I need to get in first to continue. Uh, three races once again, and our first track is Rush Hour, which I think I've been on before. Haven't I been on Rush Hour? I don't know. Three, two, I think I have. Unless I've done the reverse version, I don't know. So I did unlock new tracks, but I don't think this is one of them. Unless it is, and I'm just very dumb. I don't know. It's very possible. How do I unlock this car that's in front of me? I have not used that car yet. I want it. Oh my god, this thing is slow. But it probably packs a punch. And by that, I don't know what I mean. Because I can't really take people down and... Uh, oh, pfft, goodbye. See you in the next life, bud. I didn't want to be on the side, but you know what? Crest ahead. Careful. Crest. Oh, boost is available. Let's go. You love to see it. Oh, this is the reverse version of the first track that I raced on. Because it's all the, uh, the interstate. Isn't it? I think it's called Interstate, originally. Burnout. I did a burnout in Burnout. <laughs> oh shit, we're good. I'd say it's kind of rush hour, because there's quite a bit of traffic here. Yeah, I don't know. This thing's not really fast at all. And it doesn't really slide either. Oh shit. You'd expect the, the cars to the farther right on the me uh, on the menu to be the faster cars, but I don't know if that's true for this game. Yeah, I'm gonna use the nitrous again, a boost. I almost just died. Go. It's fine. I can recover. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Holy shit, how have I not died yet? Oh my god. I'm getting so much boost back. I'm just constantly using it. This is terrifying, so I, I appreciate the boost. I appreciate uh, letting me know that I'm doing something fucking crazy. Yeah, I'll use more of it, why not? Careful. We're good. Okay. I survived. I don't know how I survived that, but I sure did. It's just like never ending boost. Oh, come on, don't slow down. All right, I'm going to go to the actual correct side of the road here this time. Why are you getting over? We. I guess you also have to race down the wrong side of the highway. I don't think there's an option to go down the other side during that last little section. Oh boy. Go through here. Oh. I was wondering where the AI were. I was about to look back, and as soon as I looked back, one of them crashed. Nice. Oh shit. We're good, we're good. Maybe this thing's strength is that it's so slow that it's hard to wreck it because you have a lot of time to think about what you're doing. And it is time to go the wrong way down the highway for who knows how long. Oh god. Careful. Okay, just go. See if I can do it again. Oh shit. I guess you could literally just follow the lines too, because it doesn't seem like the traffic tend to 
switch lanes all too often. So you can literally just follow the line and just go straight between them. It's not what I was doing on the first lab, but you know what? I'll do it on this lab because it's less terrifying than trying to go from side to side. Okay. Okay. One more lap. I have not crashed yet. I'm probably going to jinx myself saying that, but you know what? I like to jinx myself. Take that. Car karma? I don't think that's karma. I don't know the lore of jinxing yourself. <laughs> the hell am I saying? Boost available now. We. Because it didn't go absolutely flying over that. Doesn't seem like getting air is very easy in this game. Like I've only been able to do it like once or twice on like a specific track, and that's it. Okay. Through the little city section here. Ooh. Don't know where the. Oh yeah, you're still just chilling back there. Hey. Don't seem to have much of an interest in actually being competitive. Still. I'm going to wait till I exit this section and get back on the highway, which is roughly here. You know what? Sure, why not? Okay. Now get over here. Oh. Spooky. Okay. Everything is cool. Everything is going great. Just don't let off. Well, this is a good time to do that on the last lap of all things. Come on. Give me nitrous, please. If I lose now, I'm going to be really upset. Um, I don't think I'm going to lose because the AI is too stupid. Thank you, AI, for being stupid and letting me win still. I probably shouldn't have won that, but you know what? I don't care. Um, we'll take a thumbnail on a different track. All right, six and a half a minute total time. And I crashed a total of once at the end of the last lap. Very nice. That's my name. Don't wear it out. Alright, I had one of the biggest crashes. Oh, that's of all time, I guess, because it's a bunch of different tracks. And I got the fastest race time, and the second fastest lap time. Hmm. And we continue on to our second race at Country Chaos. Oh boy. Need to be in first place once again. Sure, I'll give it a try. Why not? Three, two, I really like the music in this game. It's a very interesting, uh, interesting mix, I guess you could call it. Isn't this just the other track? But like forward again? I don't know, maybe. Holy shit! <laughs> The silver car made it through, no! <laughs> the hell is that crap? Come back here. Yeah, I don't really, I'm, I'm failing to see what the, uh, the advantage of the truck is over other vehicles. Yep, that's cool. Okay, come on. Please, why is there so much traffic directly in my way? Well, the good news is that no other AI seem to be able to pass me at all. The bad news is that there's an AI way out ahead of me. Um, watch me just go on the, the wrong side of the road to be safer. I guess that's something I could say about my situation at the moment. All right. 
Where are you at first place? I see you. Wow, you're pretty far ahead. Oh my god, please go that way. Thank you. Wait, is this a different layout? Because this is the same section I did in the previous episode. I don't know. Is it... Is it just this... Oh, I lost my boost, too. I just had boost. God damn it. The music changed. Um, I don't know. I don't know if it's like the same track or an alternate path. I don't know. I haven't paid attention enough. I'm still in second, which is ungood. First place has not completely fucked off. But I do have a chance still. Careful. Uh, they crashed and then I crashed in the exact same spot. Come back here, you bastard. Alright, stay to the left to have a better chance of surviving or else that's going to happen. Yep, stay to the left some more. Stay far to the left, yep. Okay. That when the wrong side of traffic is the safer way to go. Um, this may or may not be a bad idea. Please. Why did you swerve, you bitch? Oh, the AI are going to crash too, so it's fine. Everything is wonderful. Okay, through the off-road section. I think this truck actually comes back in, like, Burnout Revenge. I think it's a, uh, a crash vehicle in Revenge, at least. If I remember right. Or something similar. Which is kind of cool that they reuse, like, the older designs, because they're all just, you know, fake vehicles. Burnout has and always will be not real vehicles. Because literally the point of it is to crash, and car manufacturers don't like seeing their cars do that in a video game. But if the company pays them enough, they might. That's how you get games like Forza, and not really Gran Turismo, and Need for Speed. Oh shit. Okay. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. I don't know if this is a good idea. Probably not. I think this is where I used this the last time and then I died. So we'll we'll lay low on it for a second here. And I've used it. Understandable. Finish line's like right up here. And I don't see the AI. Ugh. That was spooky. Okay. Well, that was decent, at least. Apart from the hardest race I've ever done in my life. Not the easiest one, though. Alright. Okay. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. How many times I crash? Oh, a lot. Too many. And there's our stats. We shall continue on to our final race of this championship. I did get a fastest race time, second place, and the fastest lap overall. Hell yeah. I don't know how I get one and not the other, especially when they're like, I get it by a lot. I don't really know how that happens. But our final track is Sunset River. And of course I gotta get in first. We shall see what this track is like. Uh, it looks like the same track as I've done a couple times, but sunset, I guess? I don't know, maybe. Because this is actually the correct direction now, or the... <laughs> oh 
my god. Oh, I barely touched that. That's shenanigans. I'm calling shenanigans on that. Go, please. Oh, rip. Whoa, okay, that was... That was a little intense. Okay, this is going... What? Oh, I mean... <laughs> I rolled through the checkpoint and it counted. That's hilarious. Oh my god. I was I I almost actually lost technically. All right, I got to figure out where first place is and I also have to go fast so I don't miss any more checkpoints. Or almost miss any more checkpoints. Come on. Make it. Yep. I am actually surprised that I almost ran out of time for the first time in this game. Oh, Lord. Somebody died behind me. Okay. I am catching up. I will catch up completely. Red car. Red coupe. I think that's what it is. I don't know. Something like that. Oh, rip. Almost have boost. That could have went very bad the way I did that. But apparently it was fine. All right, boost available. You know what? It's time to use it right now. Okay. Uh, I will attempt to survive this. I survived it. Not every day I can say that about me and boost. Boosting. Okay, go to the left. This is a fun game. I can definitely say that, you know, Burnout 3 and Revenge and whatever else are definitely more interesting. But for our first game in the series, this game's fun. Uh, it's got a little bit of interesting quirkiness to it. And it's a little interesting to control sometimes, but... Oh, shit. I survived that somehow. Okay. But I'd say it's a fun game. There's also not a whole lot of content. It's kind of... It's kind of like an arcade game. That has, like slightly more length to it than a normal arcade game. Oh my god. Oh my god. I knew something bad was going to happen in that section. I could feel in my bones. Damn. Almost to our final lap here. And lap of the final race. Gonna get boost here. Oncoming time. Give it to me. Give it to me, baby. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Um, sure, I'll go down the wrong side of the road. This was a lot safer than the other side. Still safer. Is it gonna just... Oh, oh god. It didn't actually do a burnout. Okay, now's when... Damn. Well, okay, that works. That's actually perfectly fine in my book. Careful around there. The roundabout is dangerous. The cross traffic is what really gets you in this game. Again, similar to Need for Speed Underground 1, uh, it just kind of comes out of nowhere. You don't really have much of a choice but to commit to the bit a lot of the time. I'm trying to get boost before the race ends. 
That was not how you boost. Holy shit. Okay. I think the finish line's like straight ahead from here, right? I think so. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. That was so close. But there we go. There was that. Did I crash at all? I did crash a couple times. On all three laps, actually. And we shall continue to uh, see. I did get the fastest time overall for that track. I got the third fastest lap. And that is it. I'm apparently not good at getting points or being a bad driver, interestingly enough. All right, so the Twilight Grand Prix has been completed. I've unlocked Face Off 4, and I've unlocked the USA Marathon. Oh boy. Uh, I still don't have whatever the other weird car is that I've seen in races, but I guess it's not that big of a deal. So that will conclude this episode of Burnout. Thank you all so very much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode.